Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Monday, June 13th, 2016. The tarot card for today is the High Priestess. Now, while she's not the complement to the Hermit, there's a little bit of similarity here. You know, we saw the Hermit yesterday, and, and I have to tell you, this is, I would think, yes, definitely, a time of deep reflection. A time of going within, you know? What is that inner voice of yours telling you? There is a lot to think about right now. And, you know, I, this is a reminder that I, I think I've had every day this past week. Everyone's story is different. Everyone is at a different place on their path. But across the board, it really is an equal thing. Okay. This is what you need to remember. Sometimes everyone gets so focused on their own life that they forget to see the workings of the universe. And that may be part of today. All right. This may help you get to the future to understand that it's not just you. All right. And that all those actions and reactions and detours and blind spots that everybody's had in their lives it's all leading everyone somewhere okay so the life that you've had taking place and the life that is coming they're two totally different things and so many are asking well how is this even possible and that is how it's possible because it's happening to everyone and as difficult as that is to fathom stop pay attention listen Okay. What are others saying? What's going on in someone else's life? Once you start to see those patterns, you gain a, a not just a better understanding of the universe, but a better respect. And I think that with this card, uh, the energy of the high priestess, you can learn to trust your intuition and your gut feelings about situations. And, but it involves having a focus that goes beyond yourself okay because if your focus is too much on you and i don't mean taking care of you that's a totally different thing okay and i don't mean spending all your time taking care of others or, or that type of thing this is about having uh, the ability to see what's going on in other people's lives and not in the sense of abilities but the idea that you listen to what others have to say so when you listen to what others have to say you can also listen to your own self and have a better sense of you know judgment in your own guidance and where you should be now i'm also looking at this and i'm thinking oh you know it's monday for so many of you there is this you know you're going back to work you know another work week and what's going on hmm sometimes this card can bring about things that are are hidden from you you know like perhaps someone has a hidden agenda i do receive you know messages from people who are having trouble within the workplace because there's someone who it could be jealousy could be whatever but things are happening and this isn't something that's meant for everyone this message but it may apply to some of you out there and i think that with the whole intuitive going within, it also asks one to be more mindful of what is without, you know, around you, in your surroundings, okay? Because if you just go in to work and you say good morning and you go on about your business, but you're not observing what others are doing in their lives, you may not notice that person that has it out for you until it's too late. So that's just a, it's not a meant to make anyone paranoid type of message. It's just there for some of you because there are things that are happening and you might need to be aware of them. I don't want to see anybody be blindsided. But overall, this really is another day of introspection and really thinking about that next phase you know, I'll be honest with you, when I talk to my friends and everything and they, everyone's mind is kind of boggled. No one's quite certain what that next phase is. But 
They know what it is not. And that's what's important, is that you've reached that point that you know what is no longer a part of your life, what is no longer acceptable, whether it be, you know, um, emotional or something tangible in the real world. Things are changing. And you need to maintain that balance within yourself kind of a self-guidance thing going on but truly there are some major forces at work here this month probably one of the most powerful months of the year and I just yeah I'll wait until I do that solstice video the response has been overwhelming <laughs> so maybe I'll stop here and I'll work on that. I want to thank you all for listening. And I'll see you here tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.